What is up, everybody? Most of you know that I'm a chef. I've been in the culinary world for about the last 10 years since I could really start working. And this year was kind of the year that I really wanted to do more cooking content, long form and short form. Probably is going to be a bit of both. Today, we have a little bit of a ramen hack that I kind of came up with. Uh, I sent it out to friends. Shout out Chovy. Chovy's made this before. It's really good. Especially for if you're kind of just sick of like the regular ramen packages, wanting to make like a quick um, Alfredo cream sauce, I guess, uh, real quick. Because I was in the mood one time and I kind of made it. It was so good, I wrote it all down. I got a bunch of stuff for to make cooking content. I got a ring light that in the stand kind of, but this is on because I'm actually recording this for my phone and I got this lavalier mic. Hope it's working. So I don't really know what else to say. All right, let's just get into the, the food. You know, the reason why you're here is because you're hungry. And you know that I can make good Bahamian food, so let's, let's, let's just go. So first off, I kind of just make the noodles like ahead of time. You don't need to make the ramen noodles like on the stove. Um, I have this like thing that I could just put in the microwave, which you guys saw and just microwave up, but it's still seasoned the water. Always seasoned pasta water. I put that in for like three minutes in the microwave. It's usually pretty good right after, and then and let's just start building the sauce. I have a, a can of cream of mushroom. I like mushrooms, so uh, we'll use a cream of mushroom can. Render that down with a little bit of butter and a little bit of milk, and kind of let that simmer until it bubbles. The moment it bubbles is when we're going to add um, the seasonings. Salt, pepper, oregano, garlic. And if you, this is the time, if you, or you could just add Italian seasoning. Also, if you want to make this spicy, this would be the time to add any like hot sauce. Um, I almost, I almost did that, but I wasn't really in the mood for anything spicy today. And then, and then you put the seasoning packet in. Why you have it? Why not use it? You know, uh, the the seasoning packet is good. I mean. Um, I, the only one I don't know this would be good with because I haven't tried it is with the shrimp flavor. And it's not one of my favorite ramen flavors. I'm sure it could be good, like shrimp alfredo is a thing, so um, I'm not, it's, it's probably going to be good. It, it will be good. So, yeah. And you kind of just let that render it out until the noodles are all set. And then you just kind of throw the noodles in and kind of toss it. And I failed at tossing uh, and spilled everything everywhere. So, nice. And then and I ate it. And it's really good and topped it off with some chives. You know, and it was hot, but <laughs> it was sure was good. And, you know, quick, easy ramen hack for you to, you know, try out. Could be short form, this could, this could be long form. I have no idea. One thing I know is you should go to Street X and get this. This is cool. Yeah, okay, I'm leaving now.